some exercises on a board and we're going to do a dice warm up. We have come up with all of our own exercises for each number on the dice. Okay, our number one is jumping jacks, our number two is burpees, our number three is push ups, our number four is air squats, our number five is crack, crack kicks, and our number six is sit ups. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to roll the dice and whatever it lands on, that's the exercise we're going to do, and we're going to do 10 of those exercises. I have two of my assistants and we'll just go for a few minutes just to get our bodies nice and warmed up. Okay, you guys ready? Okay, and you want to roll it first? Oh, I hope you get two. Whoa, one. one. All right, so now you guys are going to do 10 jumping jacks. Ready? 10 jumping jacks. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, activity for you guys planned today. Um, this activity is called a preposition, a preposition obstacle course. Okay, come in a little bit closer and we're going to talk about what a preposition obstacle course is. Okay, first of all, a preposition is anything a mouse can do to a box. A mouse can go on a box, it can go around a box, it can go in a box, it can go under a box. So we've come up, I've come up with a couple of prepositions that we're going to use for our obstacle course. Okay, look at my chart, our map that we made. Okay, so this map right here is a map of uh, our backyard. Uh, you can see there's a tree, uh, there's the fire pit. Uh, we have a jungle gym over here, swing set uh, with monkey bars. Uh, we have 
two hammocks over here. We have a trampoline and we have a sprinkler right here in the middle of the yard. Okay, and if you'll notice that um, for every of the, all the objects in the backyard, we're gonna use prepositions to uh, do something to those objects, okay? Now, the prepositions that I chose, the prepositions that I chose are as follows. I chose to go around, up, across, on, down, under, in, out, on, off, and past, okay? Those are some of the same prepositions that you can use. You can come up with your own, but I'd like to see you guys use at least six or seven prepositions of your own. Right here at the sprinkler, we uh, uh, typed up the word past, okay? So we're gonna go past the sprinkler, okay? Does that make sense, okay? So if you guys uh, will follow me, we'll kind of take you on our obstacle course as uh, Emma is going to go and get ready to do the obstacle course with us. So Emma, come on over here. We're just going to walk through it the first time, okay? Emma's going to start right here, and she's going to go to the tree, and the tree says to go around the tree. So she's going to go around the tree, and she's going to go around the fire pit, and she's going to come to the ladder, She's going to go up the ladder. She's going to go across the monkey bars. And she's going to go on to the fort. After she goes on to the fort, she's going to slide down the slide. She's going to go around. She's going to go underneath the hammock. She's going to go in the hammock. She's gonna go out of the hammock. See the word out right here? Out. Right there, out. And then she's gonna come over here to the trampoline. She's gonna go on the trampoline. I bet she might even jump. Then she's gonna go off the trampoline. And then she's gonna go past the sprinkler. And then she's done. Okay? So, <laughs> what your challenge is, is for you guys to get in your own backyards. It could be in your front yard. Uh, it can be in a field, uh, maybe even a park somewhere. Um, and you're gonna create your own obstacle course to see how fast you can go through. And then maybe your brother or sister, um, they could do the same obstacle course and they could time themselves to see who is the fastest going through the obstacle course. It's a fun activity. Remember, it's called preposition preposition obstacle course uh, you want to try to come up with about six or seven prepositions of your own or the use some of mine uh, to use in your obstacle course okay we're gonna watch Emma perform it full speed okay and of course we have some music because everything's better with music ready Emma yeah. on your mark And stop right there. All right, Bethany Elementary, you guys go for it. Use your purpose to show obstacle course. Hope you have a great time doing it. There's my music.